ready? I am ready. Okay, lower it down. That's cool. Beautiful. Do you see it? Володя, do you see the flight of it? It's beautiful. Really beautiful. And you can see the sun is being reflected. It's absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it's difficult to take it as a focus. Yes, we can see it via six cameras. Beautiful. It was absolutely gorgeous. A little bit under an angle, 10 to 15 degrees to a service module. All right, let me stow the, the camera. Did you take a photo? Are you going to leave it here or take it with you? I'll see. Sphera satellite deployed at 1.29 p.m. Houston time. As the uh, crew was two hours, 53 minutes into today's spacewalk. Still working ahead of the timeline now as they send this 20-pound uh, steel sphere into Earth orbit for the next uh, anywhere from two to five months. Developers hoping for uh, a three-month orbit to be able to use this sphere to uh, verify the ground tracking equipment is uh, working properly. And the circular handrail of the service module, that's where I'm going, right? That is correct, with the kit itself. Right. All right, I'm going to swap them, uh, to swap the retractable feather. Onto the handrail, if I can reach it. If only I can reach it. Let me see. satellite is moving away from the International Space Station, moving uh, aft of the space station's uh, direction of movement and below it in orbit. Do we start then? So we start with the launch kit? That uh, launch angle determined as one that would uh, prevent the satellite from uh, coming back to be uh, orbital debris that would be in the way of the International Space Station. The hook and as it moves away, the uh, spacewalkers are getting ready back at the uh, hatch of the pier's docking compartment to move on to the next task, the uh, uh, the final uh, priority task of today's spacewalk. That's the installation of five debris shield panels on the uh, small diameter section of the uh, space station's Svesta module. Uh, All right.